Hello and welcome to Urban Farming. I'm your host, Jordan. Today we're going to be seeing an update on my garden for this week. The cucumbers are growing well. I just actually picked a few. Can't wait to start pickling them. The tomatoes are coming are coming along. Uh, I've actually got some cherries. Actually, it looks like they might be ripening up at the bottom. They look like they're going to be really delicious once they're ready. Now all the beef steaks in the front here, they're coming along. Apparently I said that too much. Those ones are going to look great on some bacon and tomato sandwiches. So the ones over here, I'm definitely looking forward to the fall when I can start canning these and making some more homemade salsa. I'm kind of running out of salsa from last year. Now the zucchini, I've picked most of it. But actually the bean plants that are here, they're coming along. I actually had, didn't have good luck with them last year, the ones that are here. They're dwarf beans. They turn like a purple-pink color. They look actually kind of nice. My Brussels sprouts, they're about now about a foot and a half, two feet tall. So they're they're growing well. My peppers here, they're doing pretty good. Now actually, if we check over here in these grow bags, these two peppers, actually I got a nice pepper right there and actually right back there, I got another one. So those should hopefully be ready another three or four weeks. The potato plant, I'm hoping it's doing well, but I have no way of checking until we disturb that soil. Now the, these bean plants are starting to get back to where, I mean, they're still about four weeks behind, probably where they should be right now. Due to that rabbit, unfortunately, getting in here and eating away. But since this has gone up, the rabbit has been staying out, thankfully. Now this, these are kind of coming back. I did plant one or two extra bean plants and the ones that did survive the rabbit invasion earlier. These pepper plants are starting to come. These peppers are a little smaller. They don't get as much sun as those grow bags. Just those grow bags get a little bit more sun. Now I rearranged the uh, cucumber thing. I mean the patch here. Because I had put this cage originally all the way down. I've decided to try to open that up so I can get more access so I can reach in here. So that's hopefully going to help. And now there's a nice little spot here for the grow. I, I may run another layer here so they can grow up. But either way, I'm going to have a lot of cucumbers. There's actually a few bean plants in here growing. So hopefully they grow well. The broccoli looks like it's bolting to seed because it is way too warm. So unfortunately, I think I missed the opportunity to pick some broccoli. Now the carrots are coming. Carrots are doing all right. Unfortunately, they've also had the invasion of squirrels in this bed. And then the strawberries are pretty much done for the season. And the... Uh, Raspberries, oh, I picked some of those today. They were amazing. I found out that my dog, Gunner, which you can hear in the background barking, he loves eating uh, raspberries, apparently, right off the uh, vine. Didn't know that until today. No more Gunner. Now, the blackberries should hopefully be coming in soon. There's a lot of flowers, so look forward to seeing uh, future updates. If you enjoy these videos, please hit that like and subscribe button and have yourself a fantastic weekend.